This tutorial shows you how to create branching scenarios in iSpring Converter Pro. You can either use a simple advance to the next slide structure to add a narrative field to your presentation, or use branching to make it follow an individual path for each viewer. To set up branching, click the Presentation Explorer button on the iSpring toolbar. Branching can be set for individual slides from the branching column and for multiple slides by selecting them and clicking the branching button on the top bar. The first slide contains links, so I want users to navigate using those links, but not the next button on the presentation player. So I can set forward branching to none. Now click OK. For the rest of the slides, you can also change the behavior of the back button to take users back to the main menu. Just select them all, and click the branching button on the toolbar. Set backward branching to slide 1 and click OK. Now let's click Save and Close to return to the presentation. To see branching in action, click the Preview button on the iSpring toolbar. On the first slide, the Next button is locked, so I'll click on one of the links. And now when I click the Back button, I'm taken back to the main menu. Did you like this video? Give it a like and subscribe to the iSpring YouTube channel for more updates.